All right, hey guys, what's up? This is Kula here. So, it's been too long. It's been too long, and finally it's here. The new expansion is coming, I think, what, mid, mid-March or something, or end of March? Uh, the Dawn, Dawn Edge Night Break, I think it was? Pretty hype, guys, pretty hype. We got this new mechanic called the Choose, where you could either choose one, one or the other. Uh, there's gonna be like two abilities on one card, which is kind of good. I mean, it really, it always reminds me of the uh, Keeper of the Grove from Hearthstone, right? That choose ability. 2-4, four, 4 mana. It was so strong, but it got nerfed. But anywho, uh, the, possibility, the possibilities are infinite, it feels like, with the uh, the choose mechanic. So that's really nice. I'm, uh, I'm going to enjoy that for sure. And uh, the Vanya reprint is nice, but... I was hoping for something new as well, you know, like, we've seen so many reprints, like, yeah, like, I love reprints, sure, I love him. Give me something new too. Please, side game. <laughs> and I would also want a new rarity, you know, like, a mythical rare. Just one rare that you could keep in your deck, you know, just one. That would be so nice. And just make it OP as fuck. I don't care. Because you can only put one of them anyways, right? That would be nice, I thought, but uh, I don't know, that might break the game to be honest, but <laughs> that's just my fault. But here we go, um, I'm going to be playing with uh, a Swordcraft deck, it's pretty simple, they're all taunts. I'm going to try that, the 40 taunt deck, let's do it. <clears throat> Alright, so let's go, game one. See, I was also thinking how like there should be another rule in uh, Hearthstone. I mean, not Hearthstone. Shadowverse. You must die. <laughs> okay, so here it is. Um, it should be a double deck format where when you go into like ranked games or anything, right, you get to choose two decks amongst all your decks and stuff, right? Say like an aggro and a control or something, right? And you get to see who you're facing first. No, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. Never mind. All right, so don't need roll and the incorruptible. We need the bell ringer, angel, the goblin mount. Oh, we got the two, three, four. That's really nice. And we're facing against forest craft. Nice. I love facing forest crafts. <laughs> if they if they ain't haven or Daria ruin, I'm happy. I'm pretty happy. <laughs> Alright, so first of all, I'm gonna put out the Bell Ringer Angel. Ding dong. End my turn. Maybe a goblin mount on the third turn. The Mirage Defender. It's a it's a decent card, you know, it's a four mana, three, four, hey, four. It's pretty bland, but it does its job, I guess. Right, so that's alright. Alright, so we got a white paladin as well. Let's put the goblin Get mount over. Let's uh Let's go, please. Oh, come on! Oh, he does not know what's coming. Man. He does not know. 40 taunts is coming right to him. Ooh, I was thinking of putting in, uh, what is it, a cannon? Uh, support oh, cannon in here, but... Gotta make it a 40 taunt deck. <laughs> so... It seems like it's gonna be like a roach deck that I'm gonna be facing, so... Let's put out that Mirage Defender, deal with that 1-1 one, one, Jerry, and my turn. What is he gonna do? He's probably gonna evolve something and deal with that Mirage Defender or something. Okay. Oh yeah. Two Sylvan Justice. You're done for. Nice, okay. So I might put out the Goblin Mountain Demon here. That would be really nice here, I think. Let's just put out the Goblin Mount Demon. Do I want to evolve that? I don't really need to, I don't think. So I'm just going to end my turn. I think I want to evolve the White Paladin once he put, puts out some uh, fairies or something. Although they have that really strong amulet though. What is it called? Hey, uh, let's nope. Nope, I completely forgot what that name was. But you know the one where it gives you Clash 1, right? It won't be long now! Oh, interesting. Okay, so, so a fairy and a goblin? 
Nice. Worth. That was worth. Nice. Okay, this is where I'm going to put out the white paladin. And it's going to do so much work. Okay, the white paladin. Let's all that. You are done for. I'll cut all the wicked we won't give them an Let's deal with one of them. Um, I could put out the Lord General Romeo or the Goblin Mount. Uh, the Fanfare three six is pretty good, so I'm just gonna My keep that actually. Is a sinful red. Five taunts. What you gonna do? The front guard general is such a good taunt. Oh my god. It's so good. Good value. So we're clearly facing against a rogue deck. Let's see what we can do. Hopefully he doesn't have the elephant as well, because that would just kill me. And if you guys hear any like, you know, the shaking sound or something, that's that's my loser again. It's, uh, it's being active again. I'm coming to you. Alright, so we got three taunts up. Okay. Okay. So he used all his, uh, what, all his evolved already, right? Evolves. I could put out the front guard general here, I think. Yeah, let's do that. Let's put the front guard general out. Let's evolve that, deal with that. So that's probably a roach, that's probably a roach, and that's probably a roach. <laughs> so he probably has his like roach deck complete already, you know? Alright, let's go. Comrades. All right, let's put out the Roland. Yeah, let's put the Roland out. I got the incorruptible oh, the the Run away! Oh, come oh, on! Run! Run! Hmm, Crystalia Aaron. Oh, hey yo! Seems like my roommates are back. Hmm. Pardon? Hold down the phone. Who's that? No. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, uh, okay, well, uh, this is the reason when I guess I can't. <laughs> you wouldn't! I should have foreseen this. 